How's it going y'all? This is Jacob. Got some upgrades for the Seahawk that we're gonna start putting on today. Uh, so here it is. Got a, a big box. It is a new Tarova 112. 72 inch shaft, 112 pound thrust. It's a very large box. So I'm gonna pull this out and show y'all. I got a quick release bracket for a troll motor. Uh, need a new jack on the trailer and a new roller. So I'm gonna put those on too. Show you my roller on the Seahawk here. This one locked up and totally the hole's just digging into it. So I'm gonna replace that. And my jack is starting to lock up, so I need to replace that. But yeah, I'll pull this troll motor out and show you all what it looks like. Give me one second. All right, here it is, a 72 inch, 20, or 36 volt, excuse me, Tarova. 112 pound thrust. So it's a big troll motor, 72 inch. So, got the head up here. This is Bluetooth, as you can see there. So I can connect it to my phone. And these are made on my phone. Uh, here's the prop comes with, weedless wedge. Heading sensor, um, got the small remote, this is not the link, I really didn't want the link because I don't have any hummingbird stuff. Just got the basic remote, that's all I need. I think this is a lift assist, and this is just the hand deploy one. I don't. I didn't want the Altera with the uh, auto deploy and stuff. So this is a beefy lower unit on this thing, compared to my other one. But yeah, well, I'll get it all set up, I gotta get this mount on. It's a little different than my other one. Um, two holes should line up, it's a little longer. So I have to do that and then wire up the third battery. Um, thinking about going to lithium. Really not sure what brand to get. Um, if any of y'all run lithium batteries with your troll motors, let me know. Let me know what brand to get based on warranty, whatever. This is a 36 volt. So yeah, um, also shout out Thunderbolt Electronics. That's where I bought this. Delwood Jack, who's the owner. He was awesome. Got me this motor in like three days. And the mounting bracket told him exactly what I needed. Sent me a quote right over and I ordered it. So yeah, so I'll get this all mounted and show you all how it looks once I get it on the boat. And I'll definitely show you all once I go fishing, hopefully later this week. Got a lot of work to do this week, but uh, I'm gonna try to go fishing. Yeah, I just got my new roller on. So that should be good there. This is the non-marking one. And like the black is kind of crumbled. Then new jack. That one's getting a little worn out. So yeah. Alright, I'll show you all once the motor's on. I gotta wire up another battery in there and uh it'll be good to go. Alright, well here she is. Pin's a little hard to get in, but uh, it's on. Had to mount this bigger plate instead of this old one. Uh, so just had to crawl under there, put that on, put two strips of aluminum underneath just for some backing. And yeah, it's perfect. So, put it up, set the foot pedal. Try and do this with one hand. Yeah, perfect. Got my little foot on here that I made so the head won't bounce. Yeah, we're good to go. Just gotta hook up the batteries. I need a new plug for this, which is coming. So I will check back in with y'all once that's in. Then I can wire this thing up. Alright, stay tuned. Alright, y'all, troll motor is on. She is powered up. Ran to the plug here. Um, so I just put another battery in here. Got a breaker there, 60 amp. Um, this is what I'm gonna run for now till I get a lithium. Then I can just put a single lithium up on the shelf. Uh, I just gotta hook up my charger, got a three bank charger. So just gotta hook that up to each of the batteries. Plugs here. So I can just undo that, plug it in, hit power. 
It's on, battery tester, it's stowed right now. Also, you can pair this to your phone, which is pretty cool. So I'm gonna go ahead and deploy it. I'll show you how it works. So, let's get up here, hit foot pedal. Here's your remote. So if you want the motor to go. It's only on two. Same so moves. Then you got spot lock, autopilot. It's to control your heading. I didn't want the big remote. This does not have the link. Yeah, this would be perfect. Very long shaft as you can see. 72 inch. So again, shout out to Thunderbolt Electronics for getting me this so fast. And should be fishing Friday. And then I can try it out and see how it is. So thanks for watching. Like and subscribe.